Capricorn, hello and welcome back. Tonight we're going to see the energies that will be born for you. And we're talking about mid of October 2022. So let's see Capricorn. What are you going to have? Energies and persons uh, that will approach you this period. We'll see everything. Also, where are you coming from? Where you're heading to? Energies and persons that uh, you don't know. Your strength, your focus, of course, your hopes. Absolutely potential outcome, a very significant message that you have to know. And we will get deeper into all these energies. So Capricorn, are you ready? If you are ready, let's start. So difficult, there is love or a contract, but it feels so difficult with the ten of wands. Why that difficulty? What's going on there? What has happened? You have been very happy in the past. There was something that you wanted or made you feel very happy. Your intuition, you can be safe, you can trust your intuition, and at the same time, there is someone. The King of Pentacles that can be very significant for you and can support you so much. Let's see now your future. Mm, interesting. Maybe you want to leave something, change job, uh, leave behind a partnership, leave something or stop be entertaining a situation in your life. Wheel of Fortune, something is changing, and again comes the King of Pentacles. That person is going to change many things in your life. Your hope is to become financially independent. I see some stress and pain there. I don't know why you cannot achieve it. But love comes to you, and it will compensate everything. And you are going to be very successful. Approaches, you have to know. Approaches. Um, a financial opportunity for you absolutely things will change things will change or something much better for you Capricorn anyway let's see I love it that in the past there was at least a period of time or something that had made you so happy what happens in this dynamic take your sword and move on without allowing anyone to interfere there was a devil and the ending of this one uh, it, it could feel that it was so happy it could be toxic it could be too much it could be too powerful it could be too difficult for you to deal with at the same time it could make you very happy it could be maybe you just took your sword and say no you found out about all this toxicity or extreme power and say no I cannot deal with it anymore I'm going to make my own dreams and succeed on my own something like this you know find your own happiness and happiness is coming to you here that you focus even though you have been disappointed in the past and you are overthinking and overthinking your focus is how to overcome this this is not a uh, new energy it troubles you for some time now and you want just to overcome it to be strong to take the right decision so to go and have your happiness your sign high priestess you know that love is coming you know that uh, that something from the past will return to you because it wants you and you want that situation from the past it has to include sex and passion and desire your strength be like this and you're going to have your ace of cups capricorn be sexy use your sexuality enjoy dive into your um, deepest pleasures and needs of your flesh you know that you want it and you know that you can have it 
and it will bring you amazing results. Does it mean that you have to to leave someone behind in the past, no matter what? Yes, because sometimes you have to we have to leave a space for new uh, dynamics, new energies, new persons, new situations to enter your life, our lives, so to make us fucking happy. This is your, your future. You're going to have your Ten of Cups. That happiness. I see you that you should leave something. Yes. And what you should leave, it feels that is this King of Swords. Maybe we would not want it. Maybe we uh, have doubts. Maybe there will be a denial from that person's side or from your side. It could be. But it feels that something must change there and will change with the Wheel of Fortune. A person around you that supports you, that you're going to have news and okay. If you want, if you want, you can be, you have distance with that person, and if you want with him or her, you can become an amazing couple, a uh, very spiritual couple, Capricorn, very spiritual couple, um, couple. Falling in love or will come together quite soon. The High Priestess, the High Priestess with the Hierophant is one of the most amazing couples that you can find. And it's around uh, this period, mid of October. What is changing for you? Here's the Hierophant again. Two times the High Priestess, two times the Hierophant. The Hierophant comes to you, this person. Very stable and again lots of duality here is your other half believe it or not you want to believe it okay uh, here's the wheel of fortune again life will change for both of you for you as the high priestess for you, that person as the hierophant in between the two of you stability lots of duality here that that energy is so balanced you know the high priestess the high priestess there the Hierophant with the Hierophant, Wheel of Fortune for you, Wheel of Fortune for that person here. Amazing. Success is there, playfulness is there, two and two. Wheel of Fortune with the Wheel of Fortune, Hierophant with the Hierophant, High Priestess with High Priestess. Amazing, amazing. What comes to you is amazing. You can fulfill everything that you have. Uh, any any desire that you are going to have, you know, any dream that you are going to have. And you are hoping also to become financially independent and probably you are manifesting a contract that is very important for you, that is not that easy to have, but you want this or your soulmate. You can have it, you can have it. Capricorn, you can have it. And um, that page of cups, what is this one? Ah, this is you, why? Because a financial opportunity. No, okay, if you worry, if you think that things will not go well, if you uh, have doubts, if, it, if you're fighting with yourself, like, oh, what the fuck will happen? Am I doing the right thing or not? Yes or not? Accept this love, accept this uh, financial opportunity. It's apart from your work could be both love and money, love and uh, financial opportunity from your work environment. It will be so fucking successful. This is triumph and victory for you, Capricorn. You're going to have it regarding love, regarding uh, money. The Hierophant is an amazing person that will be in your life. Many people are in your life also. The king of, uh, of swords. Two. We saw an emperor at some point, at least I saw an emperor at some point. You have to leave someone, okay? Maybe this is why to, to get this, uh, this proposal, this contract or this love. Because you're about to leave someone and you don't want him or her anymore. Or a situation or a job. In any case, that's beautiful. This is this is out of this world, you know. Trust me, you will understand when it 
when it will happen in your life you will understand the significance of this one because it's amazing it's not ordinary energy no it's you're completely the same page like you are complementing the one the other two two bodies in one heart two hearts in one soul amazing 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 so capricorn that was it thank you so much for watching and we'll talk quite soon for november until then enjoy find your soulmate find your other half uh, progress evolve and everything will go great for you uh, thank you for watching until the end take care of yourselves and bye for now